Hello YouTube, I'm Vinny Badabucci, how you doing? And welcome back to another NHL 2-1-D-1 expansion franchise mode, number two, no I'm just kidding, number two, anyway, um, let's see, we got the go to draft interviews, um, sure, why not? Even though I don't know any of these players. Oh, I know him. Yeah, I know Lafreniere. But we're not going to get him. Um, You know what? We're going to interview the people that uh, they want us to interview. Well, we're not going to get like this to the sixth pick, right? So this would be the guy that we're supposed to get from the Sudbury Wolf. I remember the Sudbury. Bri, that's the what that was the team that I had, Um, I think, back like in NHL 16 or something. And I, I played on that team for a while before I got drafted. And uh, I think they're changed their uniforms now or something. I don't remember. Okay. Apologize if you can hear me burping. But anyways. Okay, so we got three questions. Um, do, 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 do. Uh, let's talk about his play style first because I want to know what type of play style he got. I'm very interested in talking about my play style. Good. Um... <laughs> Can you give me a quick breakdown of how you play nice? Yeah, please. He's a power forward. Okay. I don't need to know about how ready he is in the NHL. I'll know that when I draft him. You know. Okay. Um, his skills. Yeah. Weaknesses, I don't got to worry about. Just tell me what your greatest strength is. Tell me it's like your shot or something. Oh, skating? Skating? Bro, I've never... A power forward that's fast. And... Uh, okay. Alright, new topic. Um... Personality, maybe? Hmm. Yeah, why not? Screw it. I don't want to take too much time on this stuff. Um... I don't tend to get very bent out of shape about anything, and I'm very loyal. And gave a well-rounded personality. Oh, okay, cool. Sounds good. Look, to be honest, I don't really need to interview a lot of people. Um, I'm just going to mostly take with whatever my scouts recommended, because they did the auto-scouting. <coughs> and that's about it. Oh my god, he's got medium elite potential. Lafren Lafreniere's high elite. Ooh, wow, see, look at this, see, they, when I did the scouting, they didn't show shit, man. This guy's, this guy's medium franchise. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness, that's even better than, uh, that, that, yeah, that other guy. Oh, this guy, ooh, ooh, no, 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 the hell with this, we're pinning him, we're pinning this guy. Yup, what else you got for me? Bro, I, man, I'm pinning anybody that's elite. <laughs> Like, no joke. I'm pinning everybody. Yeah. 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 Okay. Uh, well, we probably aren't going to get any of these guys, but... Actually, I could just look when they tell me, but my goodness. Top 4 D. Woof. Look at all these elite guys, man. Bro, I should have left auto sc What the fuck? Bro, good. Really, bottom 6. That's the one you decide. Really? All these elites and you don't do that. I'm glad you guys showed me this because I would have never known. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Actually, I probably don't have to do this. It'll probably just show me once I get in there. Bro, how many elites are in this draft? This is great. Oh, my God. This is awesome. Oh, my God. Another high elite guy. And he's a right winger. Ooh, we could use that. Our wingers are a little bit low. Bro, and goalies too. <laughs> okay, I think I got enough guys pinned, bro. I'm just gonna keep pinning them though. Oh my god, see now these are barely an AHL guy. Why would the hell would you think I'd ever want that? I'm gonna pin this guy too because he's a high top six. Oh my god. High elite. Oh my god, yes, dude, this is great. Liam Kirk, isn't that the guy that was from like England or something? And he get oh wait no that was a guy that got drafted by like Arizona or something like that. Ain't gonna tell me huh? 
That will. I thought his name was Liam Kirk, though, but I could be wrong. Bro, I hope these aren't. I hope they're not wrong. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. The goggles, though. Oh, these are inaccurate. Bro, I know. Probably people are telling me as I'm doing this, you're like, you fucking moron. And it's like, you right. You right. All right, that that's it for now. These are inaccurate. That's why there's so there ain't that many at least. I'm about to say. All right, what's next? Let's advance today. Oh, NHL expansion draft. So the expansion draft is behind us. We now have a core of players to build around. Next up is the NHL entry draft. Once it is complete, I'll touch base with you again in a few months to discuss my expectations for the franchise and you in particular. Bitch, remember I'm the owner, so I don't give a fuck what you say. All right, let's see the trading block because our picks really excuse him what but um are really our picks though what let me see what I could like let's remove the fourth pick right I keep that third good maybe I could get something interesting for it no I ain't get rid of circuit job but like because we got so many top 4d right yeah we got a lot of top 4d Really, you see sorrows a lot. Ooh. Okay, I'm thinking, bro. Look how many top four, four D we got, dude. There's so many. Oh my god. Okay, these are all the same. So who's got the lowest overall? Or you know what? How about Pesci? Because even though he's an 83, he's a 25. He's 25. Yeah. Okay, let's add him. Right. And the hell with the seventh and the sixth. Now ain't nobody gonna even try to in the fifth. No, nobody's gonna do it. I'm just I'm just doing this for the hell of it, just to see what kind of offers I could get from people. You know what I mean? We're just we're just testing it out. We're just testing the waters, that's all. I'm even gonna test to see what I could get for UC Saros. And, and these guys are probably gonna get removed anyways. As time goes on. I'm not putting Circuit Chef on there. That's that it's one thing I won't do. He is not up for grabs, man. He is not up for grabs. And for the hell of it, I'm even going to do uh, Daniel Sprung, even though I like him. All right. Now let's try it out. Let's see what we get. Okay, now we're here at the um, NHL entry draft. Can I edit my lines yet? No. All right, let me do a quick savey save. I can't wait for you guys to see the information. I really hope there are people watching at this time. I, I doubt it. If there is, it's like only like, well, nobody's like commenting. I mean, there. I notice some people, There, I, I do get some views here and there for franchise mode. I know my first ever franchise mode, I had like 14 views. I was like, woo. It always goes down. Like, it really does. Every fucking time. Like, you make the first video, it's always going to get the most views. And then the second video is like significantly less viewers. And then less views, less views. I don't know why, man. I can't stand that. I, I hate how people just watch one video and then never watch or finish watching a series. Like, dude, I always go through the series. If I'm interested in them, I always do. And I wish people would do that with mine, too, if they, you know, would start to... Anyways, let's just get into the draft, shall we? Because I worked really hard on these uniforms and stuff, you know. I mean, I've done it before with, without, you know... I, I've done it before, um... What you call it? Without being on YouTube, you know, where I worked hard on it, but never really went through with it. But now that I'm on YouTube, you know, it's like, yeah, I want people to see this and and stuff. Okay. Do you think do you think Anaheim would be willing to trade their first round pick? That is a ton of value. You think they'd be willing to go like if I gave them Sergachev? I don't even think they would take that. Nah, I really don't want to get rid of Circuit Jeff. Nah, that's okay. I know Lefrenier, you know, high elite, whatever. But, nah. Nah, we'll just we'll just send our pick. We'll be patient. We'll wait. What do we get? So who took what? Wow, they all got elites, huh? Good for all you guys. This guy's 80 already? Are you kidding me? Pfft, he's 82. Maybe I should have traded Circuit Jeff. Son of a bitch. This guy's 83. What the fuck? Now watch me have like some shitty ass pick. 
Scouts don't fail me now. Okay, this was the guy that we interviewed. Wait a minute, hold on. This one says, though, that it's accurate. Right? Because, yeah, it's really bright. So this is our best chance. Oh, okay, the franchise guy, he's not even accurate. Okay, I am just want to see whoever does take Perfetti, what he was. Because is he really a franchise guy or no? Because if he is, I'm going to be mad. But we're going to pick this guy because he's a medium elite. Yeah. 77 overall. Okay. Per Peretti or Paletti or something like that. Let me. I'm just going to keep going until I see somebody takes him. Same pick. There he is. Ah, uh, medium elite. 72 overall. So we actually did better getting this guy. D. So it worked out in the end. I was about to say medium franchise. Anybody would have been Lafreniere. So I thought that was kind of weird. Ah, uh, here comes the uh, picks. So Sabres want our second pick. So we go five picks back. But we also get their fifth pick. Hmm. Let me see something real quick. So our pick has that much value. And theirs has just a little bit less. Hmm. I'm thinking about it. I'm thinking about it. Because then we also got a fifth pick. Let me see. Well, I'm sure we got a pick for everything, right? I mean, all we do would be going down five spots but gaining a fifth. And it's like, how useful is that really going to be? You know? Yeah. Nah, because there might be somebody really good that I want there. You know, and I might regret doing it. So, sorry, Buffalo. Okay, let's make our pick. Let's see what we got here. What we can get. Give me something accurate, boys. Watch him make sure be, like, really good. Because you know he ain't no AHL guy because he's all the way up there that high. Our best bet, even though it's semi-accurate, would be this guy. Because they didn't know how to scout properly anybody else. Yeah, that guy's a bottom six. Yeah. Alright, fuck it. We'll go with uh, this guy because it's our best chance. Top 4D. Scouts rank 32. But what does it say here? What does he expect to go to 35th? Hmm. Fuck it. We're going to take a chance on this guy because he expected to go to us anyways. He's what? He's a playmaker. He's from Russia. Hopefully I'm not wrong. Medium top 9. Eh. Nah. Eh. Alright. Yeah. All right. Next, I, I learned my life, but thank goodness I was so afraid it was actually gonna say like AHL or something. Watch the Sabers have gotten a better pick than me. Ready? There was mine. Right, Jordan Pitlick, Yarmir Pitlick. Oh, top sixty. Well, that's basically like a top nine for it. So never mind. We both didn't do that great, but not too bad, I guess either. Okay. Why well, don't I know seven D? And they scouted this guy for whatever reason. But they've been wrong before. And he's like, uh, why shouldn't be Buns? Is there anybody that... Uh, no, anybody good that you scouted? Well, he's a high top 60, but that's still semi-accurate. Alright, fuck it. We'll go with this guy, see what happens. A low top four. Alright, I can handle that. I can handle that. Oh, that other guy ain't gonna be there that I wanted. That's okay, though. That is alright. Okay, yeah, I've been this guy, but you guys ain't even got nothing accurate here about him. You know? So it's like, what the fuck? How do I know if he's gonna be good or not? But fuck it. Hey, whatever happens, happens, man. Let's try it. I doubt he's gonna be a medium elite. I highly doubt it. Watch him be like a fuck. Wait, what is he? He'll, oh, a defenseman. Watch him be a fucking 7th D or AHL. Tuck, what I say, 7th D. Yeah. Ah, well. Ah, well. It's no biggie because I got tons of guys with potential on my team. So, I mean, I'm not worried about it. I'm really not. Uh. Anybody that you scouted well enough? Okay, let me see about your selections here. Uh, no, I, damn it, it's not going to show me what the... Nah, of course not. Unknown. 
Uh, I'm just gonna do it this way. Network that. Well, this is complete. Wait, no, this is very inaccurate. This is inaccurate. Oh, jeez. Wait a minute. Hold on. We got a semi-accurate top nine. Okay. Oh, oh those are all a bunch of seventy. Okay. See, yeah, the rest of it's kind of poo-poo. Okay. All right, we'll just try this guy then, see what happens. If he's a top nine or whatever, probably bottom six. He's a top six. Hey, that's even better than the low top nine or whatever. All right, we lucked out on that one then. Sim to our next pick. Um, and, whoop, I did not mean to do that. I meant to go with goalies. Let's see if we can pick up a, a, a goalie or something here. They like this guy, huh? Yeah, why not? We'll take him. Fuck it. <laughs> Let's go. He's a medium elite. What? Yo, that was just complete luck. Let's fucking go. He got a medium elite in what? Like the fifth round or some bullshit? Man, that was awesome. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. 70. What was the other one? Oh, hey, jump. You better off going with the 70. Nah. No. Alright, forget it, man. You know what, you guys, uh... You can, uh... Whoops, I meant, uh... Oh, it, it's... Yeah, just send my pick. We got bottom six, so that's cool. Sim options. Yeah, sim entire draft. I was gonna say, just sim the rest of it. There we go. The NHL entry draft is now completed. That's who we got. <coughs> man. Okay, now we gotta sim to the resign phase. And let's do it. Okay, today is the beginning of the resign phase, and you must also tender contracts if you're skaters. You have 13 skaters that are about to become restricted free agents. Oh, restricted. <coughs> yeah, but if I tender them, then they'll be here for an extra year, so it works out. Okay, well, let's go with stop simulation. We gotta go to the contracts. Oh boy, this is gonna be fun. Just had to do this with Washington. Oh, if I gotta sign people, I mean, why not? I need. I actually got a growing salary. But then again, I. Th well, actually, no. We still got, like, free agency to go. Yeah, I can still pick up 20 players in free agency. Man, how the fuck? Taylor Hall, restrictive free agent. I love how he already wants an extension. Bro, Jake DeBrust ain't even want an extension. Neither does Dermot. Damn, I never thought about that. Son of a bitch. Ah, but you're restricted free agent. You ain't got no choice. <laughs> yeah. Okay. All right, first up, let's go to the goalies, huh? Markstrom. Oh, thank goodness you want to... Uh, if, yeah, whatever. What do you want? How much salary cap I got? That's the total salary cap. Uh, Cap space. We got 51 million in cap space. He wants a contract for six years? Bro, I didn't want you that long. Uh... And you ain't even gonna change the dollar amount either. Oh, you want more if I do it that way, huh? Don't you? Okay. How about like three years? You cool with that? Or two? Why would you want more? One, I don't want to send him to one year. He probably won't accept that. I'm not doing six years. I'm sorry, Markstrom. Like, I know you in 88 and all, but you, you know. Well, to be fair, I could always trade him or something. Yeah, no, I'm sorry, though. I don't want you that long. Like, maybe three years will be good, okay? We'll do three. I'll get back to you tonight. Yeah, you do that. Uh, okay. So that's it for that. Let's just go to all skaters. And we'll go to all the guys that... Oh, my. Holy shit. I did not know this. Okay. Well, since you don't want that, actually, I'm going to qualify you as an RFA. Thank you. And I'm going to qualify you as an RFA, so you ain't got no fucking choice. <laughs> okay. I, I think with a lot of these guys, should I do it? Now, see, if they're unrestricted free agents, I got to sign them on the spot, right? But I could qualify all these guys and stuff like that just to see how they'll play. But 
I don't know, man. They all got potential. It's not like they don't. So, you know, let's get cracking at sand. But let's first sign the... Okay, Strom. Well, you're an 84, but I don't want you for that. Bro, I'm not signing you for six years. What is with these people wanting six fucking years? How about... Mm. Can I sign you for one? <laughs> for real, can I sign you for like a year? Would that be okay? Because then we'll just see how you are to your 27. You know, I want to sign. Well, then again, he might not want an extension next year. All right, how about this? How about we do four years? Does that sound good? We'll do four years. I'm going to sign you for, for, you know, I wonder if he would accept it less like that. Okay, let's see. And if he says no, then I'll just give him what he wants. Taylor Hall, yeah. Well, even though you're exact, you're you're an 88. You're 28. He wants a seven-year deal. But with the way he's been playing, he don't deserve that. But because it's a video game and he's elite and he's an 88 and he's going to be our top guy for now. Uh, I'd say I didn't really want to sign anybody long term. We'd have him until he's like 35. How about five years? Is that okay? Five years, we'll do five. And I'll offer you 7.7. 7. How about that? Okay? Sound good? It's great. Okay, anybody else unrestricted? Yeah, Anthony Duclair. Okay, see, you're 24. You went three years till you finished growing. And I find that perfectly okay. There you go. You can get your exact amount of money you want too. Okay, the rest of you now. Let's see. Let me just see something. What about Sergachev? Where is he at? Sergachev. Oh, he. Oh, he's a restricted free agent, bro. Now you get. What is, is he? Medium or low? Uh, he's a medium elite, bro. You get signed right away. He's 22. See, everybody already gained a year. See, that's why I didn't want to take no 26 overalls. You want that? You got it, my dude. Yeah, you definitely stay in. Um, okay, let me just do this actually like this. It might be so much easier for me. Walmart, yeah, I'll sign you to three years if you want. Oh, you only want two? How's three sound? Good? All right. Let's do it, man. Sign you. Okay. Left wingers. Okay. Um, just got Ellie. He's 25, so I only want to sign you for two. Guys, want to, Oh, he only wants one? How's two sound? Good enough? All right. Good. Because that way, because then I'll know by then, you know, what I can do with them. I can still offer him a contract anyways. Let's see what he says. Four years, yeah. And I'm going to give you exactly what you're asking for. How about that, hmm? Did I, uh... Yeah, okay. Right wingers. Okay, we got Guriana, which is a low elite. I signed you for four years. He went six. Wow. Uh, fuck it. Let's make it happen. Because you got that elite potential. Okay, you, Ho Sang, you're 24. Actually, I want you for three years. Really, though? That much more? Nah, forget it then. You can get two. <laughs> yeah, ask that for that much more after that, man. I forget it. Okay. Wow. Lots of defensemen to sign. Okay. You're 22. I'll sign you up to five years. Well, actually, I'm going to make sure. Let me real quick. Make sure I qualify everybody for RFA that needs to be qualified. Just in case. And it's too late once you've already signed them, huh? Yeah. Okay. So. Everybody that did not qualify yet, I'm qualifying all of you for it can't do that with him just in case anybody doesn't want to resign okay great there now all of you are tendered so that's great um okay so let's start right here with bear i'm willing to sign you up to five years you want four how about five but why you gotta ask for that much more than forget it i'm even taking that off too there 
Vince Dunn, man, my 23-year-old, 82 overall defenseman. He went a whole six years, man. How about four? What do you think about four? That good, we can do four. Because if they don't grow properly or something like that, you know, then it gives me a chance to get rid of them or have them get released or whatever, you know? But if they do grow properly, then I resign them. Okay, you just want two years for that? What do you think about four? Oh. Oh, he wants a two-way deal too? Oh, okay. Alright, we, we'll do that then if that's what you want. That's fine. How about you? You're only a 76 overall. You want two years? What about three? 1.5? Um, yeah, fine. I'll do 1.5. Okay, Phil Myers. 81 overall, 23. Did you do four years? What do you think about that? Yeah, we could do that. It's still pretty cheap. How about that? That's good enough. Okay, Zadarov, you're already 25, so I don't even want you for three years. How about two? And I'm going to offer you only two million. Okay, Dermot, you're 23. Ooh, he's at 82 already. Four years, exactly what I was thinking, my dude. Let's do it. I'll give you the exact money you want, too. Okay. I think that's everybody now. I think I re-signed everybody that I had to re-sign. No wonder all these people were left there because they had to re-sign contracts. And all the teams didn't want to re-sign them. That's okay. I re-signed them. I'm fine with that. Yep. Okay. And the goalie's perfect. I still can't believe I got a medium elite goalie in the draft, bro. And he's only 18. He might only be a 50 overall. But that's our future right there. <laughs> 12 years younger than Markstrom. 7 years behind Ninjari and Sorrows, man. So, yeah. There we go. <laughs> Alright, sweet. So, now we do a little savey save again, and we wait to see who accepts their contracts and who else wants to and who wants to play diva. So let's find out, shall we? Advance the day. <coughs> okay, Jake DeBrusque. It was an easy decision to decide to renew my contract with you. So how about that? The man who said he didn't want a contract extension, he just resigned. See, so you don't even gotta believe that. Zadarov, he signed. Let's go. Garyanov, resigned. Ethan Bear. He, yep, Lucas Walmark. Yep. Oops, sorry, I didn't get to see the last guy. Anthony Duclair. Phil Myers. Taylor Hall, let's go. Vince Dunn, yep. Mikhail Sergachev, let's go. Travis Dermott, nice. Oh, hold on. Although. I am interested in principle to an extension. I'm going to reject this offer at this dollar value. I want to win, and I don't think the team is going to be in a position to win anytime soon. Perhaps more money will change my mind. Bro, that's it. You go, bro, I'm looking for a trade with this dude. Like, I ain't even kidding, bro. I'm about to, bro, I got other goalies. I don't need you. I don't need you. You asked for way too many years for too much money. Like, nah, dude. I'll find somebody else. I wonder if I can get, like, two Karask or something, man. I mean, I'll literally trade you for Henrik Lundqvist or Flurry. Like, I don't give a shit, man. I mean, no, that's probably stupid in this game, but whatever. Okay, anyways, Josh Hosang, he resigned. Yulson, good. Ellie. Um, I really appreciate that you offered me such a generous contract. Compares my expectations. Oh, well, you're welcome, Ian McCoshin. Thank you. See, some people are being generous. Other people just want to be fucking divas. I believe everybody is signed now. Yes. Good. Everybody's signed. The only one that's left is our uh, Diva goalie. Okay. Let me advance the day real quick one more time. See if anybody else said anything. Nope. Okay. Good. So now we got the team that I did draft that was signed. The only one that's playing Diva is Jacob Markstrom. Go figure. Okay. Let's see who I can trade for him. Uh... Shit, I can't do trades, can I? I wonder if I could get a goalie in the draft, but I don't know. Oh, wait, here we go. Pending free agents. Wait, is it just my team, or can I look at everybody else? Oh, okay, cool. This is, like, the whole thing. Okay, cool. Goalies. Jacob Merckstrom. Oh, Braden Holpe? 
Bro, I'd rather have Hope Beast. Like, seriously. I'd rather have him. Can I select him? Can I offer... No. Bro, I'm gonna offer him whatever the fuck he wants. God's honest truth. But, uh... No, uh... No Lundquist. No Flurry. That's a bummer. That's a bummer. Um... But, yeah. Exact same age. Exact same overall. But I think Holpi is a better goaltender by far. Um... Yeah. Okay. But that's if Washington doesn't reset him because you see it shows Markstrom there. Um see, so I'm like debating, do I resign the fucker or do I just let him walk, you know? And he was bitching and complaining about not winning. See, like I'll go all out to spend like a bunch of money on Hopi, right? But I'm not going to do it for Markstrom, no offense. I'm sure he's good or whatever, but I don't know him too well. Where, like, I know Hope B because he used to be with the Caps, you know what I mean? And we, we don't, you know, NBCSN doesn't put out a lot of Vancouver games, you know? So it's kind of hard to, to tell with him. They put a, they put out a lot of Washington games. Um, Yeah, pending free agents. Let me just see because I need, like, I really need to start spending. I got $9 million left in cap space? That's it? Oh, I thought I was going to have to spend lots of money. Oh, look at Petrangelo, though. Ooh, 90 overall. Damn. Damn. I'm just looking through real quick. Not bad. Not bad. Not bad. It, it, you know, that's what I want to see. I want to see some, like, like, high 90s or something. Not high 90s, but, like, high super high 80s and 90s you know okay well then this kind of puts a damper on this because it's like well hey look if he walks we got uh we got sorrows and we got jari we got up and coming goaltender i can, i'll pick up one i'll find one to pick up so yeah we're, we're just gonna let markstrom walk but I'm going to save this anyways, just in case if something goes horribly wrong with this. But, um, yeah. Alright, let's do it, man. Let's just go right to free agency. Let me look at my contract. Do I really only have $9 million left in cap space? Did I really... Sp yeah, I do. Holy fuck, I didn't realize I spent that much. Yeah, I got some really expensive players on my team. Because they get the potential and they know it. But, hey... Bro, I think it's worth it, dude. I think we're playoff contenders right now. You know, I'm not going to go as far as to say we're cup contenders. I got to see how the team, you know, is in the season. But I feel like we are definite playoff contenders. I really do believe so. I believe so with my whole heart. But then again, I could be wrong, man. I've, I've done that before. I think where I... One time I had an expansion draft, like, back when it started. And I think they, like, completely were awful. So I could be completely wrong, but I feel like this is the best expansion team I've ever drafted. And they gave up a lot of good things. So let's go to, uh, should I do free agency now? Or should that be the next video? Man, it already is late in this video. So actually, we're going to end it here. And then we're going to go into free agency. So if you guys enjoyed the video, you know what to do. Peace out, everyone. Bye!